All right, so we've got some info regarding some new Five Nights at Freddy's news. The last 24 hours have been fairly active with FNAF news. We've gotten some twisted one graphic novel uh, graphic novel leaks uh, for some pages, which is interesting, really interesting. I'll do that next video. We got some McFarlane um, FNAF pizza sim and VR set, like final like images. You know, the we got the earlier versions from February, and we got completed versions of them, and they look great. And I'll show them next video as well. Uh, and then I'll do the graphic novel leaks. Um, so this is for the the FNAF coloring book, which we heard we started hearing about last month in July. So uh, let's talk about this. So uh, you can see it's mainly white because you know it's a coloring book. And um, you got some great new poses there. Uh, there's Twisted Foxy there, so I'm really um, happy that they're giving us more official artwork for the Twisted One characters because we didn't get um, too much. Work, but the, the, we haven't got too much artwork for the twist ones yet um, Well, we certainly will when the graphic novel comes out however, and yeah, so it's good that there's gonna be some artwork and some poses uh, models uh, official artwork etc for the twist ones in there and also a lot of other characters That's what I'm very uh, excited about to see some poses for some new official uh, artwork poses for characters um, so you can see the puppet up there, uh, looks like he's banging someone, like, you know, shooting them. Uh, Toy Chica down there looks colored, uh, is colored, what the fuck looks colored, no, is colored, looks great. Springtrap's pose there looks really, really fucking badass, I love that Springtrap pose. And Mangle there, really cool as well. Now, I'm not too sure why a coloring book for Five Nights at Freddy exists, I have no idea why, um, I'm just confused now. That's my only, like, bad point, why is there a coloring book? for a goddamn horror game. Well, why? It doesn't need a coloring book. Uh, I'm still gonna buy it though, because um, I'm, I wanna see what, I wanna see the poses, because I'll be interested in seeing models, uh, new models, artwork, poses, and stuff like that for the characters. And I'm not gonna color it in, because I don't see coloring as any good use. It's more like a waste of time, unless you're like an actual artist and you're actually drawing good shit. But coloring books, the drawing's done for you. You're just coloring it in. Um, you know, if if you really have nothing to do, maybe you'll buy. Maybe you'll want to color this in. Um, but yeah, maybe we'll get some lore revealed in this. That's what I'm very excited for. We might get some lore revealed in this. I know it may sound a bit crazy because how could they put lore in a coloring book? But remember, they gave us lore in the security log book. Remember, we got uh, Cassidy in there and stuff as well. And uh, thing messages left from uh, Michael. So. That was great stuff in there. And the same might happen here. There might be some secret text very faintly hidden in some of the pages, which will give us some hints to stuff. Maybe there'll be something uh, for the uh, FNAF theorists and stuff. Hopefully. Fingers crossed for that. So, yeah. Um, apart from the fact that it's a coloring book that has no reason to exist for a franchise like FNAF, um, I love how um, it's going to get so much new artwork. I'm very interested for it. And I'm going to buy it anyways because I got to keep my FNAF collection going, my FNAF book collection, I've got every one of them, and I'm not missing a single title, um, so yeah, there's the, uh, cover for it, now I know it's a coloring book, so it's gonna be white and black, but I kinda wish they'd done the entire cover in color, just to give it more color and all, and make it look more, uh, you know, nicer, I know, um, you know, say you want to display, I know, come on, uh, who displays books, but you could. I mean, I think, like, the covers are a very important factor of a book. And um, so if it was full color, that would be nice. But, you know, it's I love the Springtrap pose. I love the pose in the cover, though. I'll give it that. That looks great. Um, and I'm excited to see some of the models in there. Some of the wonderful artwork from the from Scott's official artists. Um, see how good they are. And whenever I get it, I'll give you a run-through of all the models and take a look at them. And see how good they look. All the ones on the cover, they look really good, however. Look brilliant and um, so there's a look at the official five nights at freddy's coloring book no word on release date yet um yeah it looks cool um i'm just you know coloring book five nights at freddy's i just don't get that but you know uh we've come very far there's a lot there's at this point there's fnaf merch for everything and uh, yeah fnaf taking over the planet um so yeah, if it, you know, there's gonna be a coloring book at some point. There's already bootleg ones, and I actually happen to own one. I got it a long time ago. Um, yeah, it had fucking candy in there. I'm not even kidding. I mean, it's a bootleg book, so 
And the majority of the pictures were fan art as well, have you know. But yeah, that's what you get. It's a bootleg. And this is going to be official, so we're going to have new pictures from all those ones that I cover we've never seen before. So, wait, have we seen them before? I know we haven't seen Twisted Foxy. I know we haven't seen the Twisted Foxy. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this is on new. Um, so, yeah, if you're bored out of your shell, you can go and color these in, or if you enjoy coloring in. I mean, it will be good to see them in color, though, but, you know, coloring in just isn't my thing. Um, so, there's a look at the FNAF coloring book. Leak for the cover. Still no word on release, maybe this year. Wait, I don't remember. There was a thing last month. Oh, well, anyways, there's a look at it.